prayer charge for today and our uh, how do you call it sermon is new beginning i believe i believe i believe i be people are not giving you chances people have closed you up they have closed the book they don't want to see you and you yourself they are mean i said there are some people have closed the chapter god is not like that Hosea 13, 13, God says, he gives us opportunity over and over again. And this is the season of creation where God wants to give us opportunity again. A new beginning. I prophesy a new beginning to you. I prophesy a new beginning to me. I prophesy a new beginning in your family. A new beginning in your church. A new beginning in your economics. A new beginning in your finance. A new beginning in your body. A new beginning in your mind. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. A new beginning. Come on, say it. New beginning for me. In my education. Come on, prophesy. Prophesy. Prophesy, we learned last week that in the beginning, God spoke, hey, he spoke and dispelled darkness. Job tells us in Job chapter 38 verse 12, he says, are you like God who commanded the morning, command, 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 the morning light to appear to, dis to dispel darkness. Command, command a new beginning. Command a new beginning. Come on, command a new beginning. So when some poem poor, God is giving me a new beginning and I'm stepping into it. Come on. Come on. I know how it is. Some people are scared to step into a new position, a new office, a new engagement, a new appointment. Somebody told me, Mr. Rosa, before me you, I'm afraid witches will kill me if I take this post. No, it is not you who is taking it. It is God that is offering it to you. And whatever God offers to you, he divinely protests. Come on, take it. Take it. He says in Genesis, and he sent an angel to protect the garden so that nobody. So take it. Take your new baby. Take your new husband. Take your new fiancé. Take your new church. Take your new opportunity. Come on. Take it. Take your new opportunity. Come on, take it. Say, I take it. I take it. You know what you are expecting. God is offering you. Close your eyes. Look in the realms of the spirit. See what God is taking for you. Come on. God is amending your relationship. Ah, come on. Come on. New beginning. New beginning. Your marriage is going to be new. Come on. Your life is going to be new. New identity. Come on. New wardrobe. Come on. That is what God did for Adam and Eve. And that is our theme. Come on. But I have to leave the Holy Ghost to do what he's doing. For it is the time of creation. The time of new beginning. Where the Holy Ghost is at work. Where the Spirit of the Lord broods upon the waters. The waters are your word. On Facebook. On Good News TV. Okay, we are on Good News TV and Facebook. If you are on Facebook, please share. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. God is doing something. New beginning, new beginning, ha. Huh? New beginning, share. New when beginning. they saw him, they said, was it not the man who sat and begged? New beginning, new wardrobe, new identity. As I remove my coat, prophetically, prophetically, God bless you. Hold on one minute for me. Hold on just one minute, please. I removed it to remove every cloth of shame. And now when I put it, you are putting on it. Please come for it, please. Because I'm hot. I'm just prophetically doing something for them. God did that to Adam and Eve. He put them a new cloth. And that is what he's doing. Allow the Holy Ghost. He's doing something. He's doing something. Newness. Newness. Newness, a brand new name. Didn't you read it? He says, I'll give you a new name where you were shame. God is going to give you a new name. To allow the Holy Ghost because He's brooding upon the waters. New beginning. New beginning. Ha! New beginning. New beginning. New beginning. Is it not the blind man who was begging? I that was then. God gives all of us a new beginning. Join Lady Apostle Diana Adewu on The Good News TV and on Facebook every Wednesday from 7 to 8 p.m. BSD and on Sundays from 7 to 8 p.m. BSD.
for a live virtual prayer camp encounter dub. It's a new day. Awake your dawn through the word. Worship. Warfare. On the Good News TV, that's www.goodnewstv.org.uk and on Facebook, Lady. AP, Diana Adu Christo.